Hey guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Christine. I'm working on a passion piece at the moment. This is Nickelback. Uh, these are the first couple of layers of charcoal. I'm just using charcoal pencils and just to, this here, this beautiful luscious background uh, is willow charcoal. You can pick this up from a discount store or uh, art suppliers around six or seven dollars Australian dollars for this little container. Um, so now what's next is I'm going to use, did you just hear my knee crack then? That was really loud. Um, I'm going to be using this brush to spread the charcoal across the canvas and then I'm going to use my kneadable eraser to create some highlights and I'll go in again with, these, with this willow charcoal um, just to create more definition and make it really contrasty, just to get that nice desired effect. So yeah, I'm going to do this outside because I think it's going to make a little bit of mess and uh, see how we go. I also wanted to mention I haven't used any fixative spray on this yet as well um, because I just, yeah, I need the charcoal to spread and blend. <laughs> I was kind of hoping for a less windier day, but anyway. So this is the part where I absolutely shit myself because I've never done anything like this before. This is the first time that I'm using charcoal on canvas um, and spreading the charcoal and I'm just really scared I'm going to ruin it. So I have been putting it off for about a week. I don't know about you guys, but I procrastinate when I don't want to, well, so when I'm scared about doing something, I really, yeah, I put it off. Um, but I was also waiting for the nice weather as well, I guess, but um... I'm scared. I'm nervous, but um... Let's do it. Let's do it. It's time. <laughs> So I definitely got the effect that I was after. Spreading of the charcoal. I also went in with a bottle of acetone just to create some charcoal spots there. So the next thing now will be to go in with my kneadable eraser. I'll start adding in those highlights. And again with the willow charcoal, we'll just start adding in that contrast, that real black charcoal luscious -ness. So it's the only word I can think of.
guys, another beautiful day in Melbourne today. Um, I went ahead yesterday and added in some more willow charcoal and created the highlights. Um, I just don't think that there was enough of the acetone effect, so I'm going to spray some more acetone today and then go in again with the willow charcoal um, and yeah, hopefully I'll nearly be finished. It's just about adding those really fine, nice details um, and definition. So, Let's give this another whirl. Okay guys, so it's been a few days since I added those charcoal spots and I've also gone in and added some charcoal and details. Um, I tried to film so where I was filming before, I was house sitting and the lighting was amazing and it really complemented this piece. Whereas now I'm back at home, the lighting isn't so great. So I did try to film me adding in that charcoal to get that real definition um, and it just I wasn't really happy with the video. But basically, this is what it looks like now. It's nearly finished. There were some things that I changed. Um, I changed Daniel's face just a little bit, just seemed a little bit out of perspective and I fixed his eyes. Um, I also fixed Chad's face a little bit and I still want to work on that um, but other than that I'm really happy with it I'm going to make some changes I might add some more highlights around the earlobes I might change Ryan's facial hair a little bit um, yeah but I just thought I would show you guys basically it's nearly finished and if you guys are interested in knowing how I did this piece what materials I used please comment below and I can do another video on that and show you guys if you want to see the final um, you can head on over to my Instagram at Christine Morgano. Nickelback have already seen it and they commented on one of my reels to say that they would be back for a update soon. So I really hope they get to see this and I just want to thank you guys so much for watching. See you later.